So, Ross Twyman, uh, this weekend you're at Alton Park. Um, you've had a bit of an up and down season this year. Obviously, you moved from Gale in Kawasaki, and this weekend at Alton Park, you'll be riding the GP2 for Nova Gearboxes. Um, do you have any sort of sensation or feeling about how the uh, GP2 is going to go for you? Um, yeah, I mean, the GP2 was like a uh, we had a run on it on Monday at Snetterton, that was a successful sort of thing. I, as soon as we were about four laps in, I sort of knew that that was the the bike that fitted me perfectly sort of thing. I just sat on it and it was like, yes, this is the one. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's hopefully this should be like a, a high on the end of this year sort of thing. Super, well, listen, we hope it goes very well for you and wish you all the very best for the remainder of the season. Um, we've got some questions from some of our uh, customers and followers yep. and uh, some of the people have asked, um, when did you actually realize that you were uh, good enough to, to have a go race, racing a uh, <laughs> motorbike in the British series and uh, what sort of age were you? Um, well when I first started riding on track which was a, I'd never really ridden a bike before um, it was just a bit of a spontaneous thing in 2009 to be fair um, we rode a, an Aprilia 125 at Mallory okay. and then I just I loved it so much we'd done, a next, we'd done like the practice day of a race weekend and then I said oh dad can we keep can we do the Saturday right. and then from there on um, it's just snowballed and then from there on we sort of went through the Sun Thunder Sport series yeah. and uh, then uh, got on a 600 at 2014 and then did a wild card at British Superbikes at the Donington Park World Superbike Round, Right. Uh, finished seventh and then that was the, that was the bug really. Was it really? Yeah. What, what, what age were you then Ross? I was 19. 19 and you're now? 23. 23. So you, you're almost becoming a veteran. Yeah, I am, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. Um, obviously, you've, you've visited many circuits around the world and you know for testing and, yep. and, and track days. Uh, which, which is your favourite circuit? In the UK or? No, globally. You know, if you, if you could ride any circuit and it would, which you've ridden, yep. which would be your favourite? I'd have to say Haref. Haref? Yeah. It's just fast flowing. It suits my style and the weather's nine times out of ten, it's all right. <laughs> well, we can see that, you've got a very good colour as well, so I, I quite like her red as well, you see it's in a, in a sort of a bowl, yeah. and uh, it has a great atmosphere there, so mm. yeah, good choice. Okay. Have you got any advice for anybody that wants to take up racing, motorcycle racing, or is it something they should pursue or not? Yeah, definitely, I mean, do it while you can. I mean, if, you, if you're in the position to be able to do it, then do it, because you'll regret it if you don't. Like yeah. that, you don't get the adrenaline or the buzz anywhere else and knowing what you could have done if you have ridden, if you could have that experience and then you know sometimes it gets taken away from you, it's never the same. Right. Like you, you just, it's, so it's your, just, your, your advice is if, if you've got the itch for it, get on that bike and make it light, yeah, light up. No matter what you're doing, whether it's a track day or racing or whatever, it's just you never get anything as good as riding a bike on a track. Superb. Okay. Um, now, number 18, we, we, we've been involved with you for uh, over three years now, yep. and 18 has always been your number. You moved from 15, um, or oh, sorry, sorry, Mike, correct me, did you have to move to 15 and then we've gone back to 18? We, um, I was always number 15 since I started, but um, last year, um, 2018 season, we ended up moving to number 18 because the championship I was in, um, one of the guys who was my teammate in that uh, championship, he was number 15 and always right. has been, okay. and he's been racing a lot longer than I have. So I don't think it would have gone down too well if I, uh, if I used that, but um, 18 was always my second choice anyway. Right. So. Oh, well, listen, it's a good number. It looks yeah. good on your suits and, yeah. you know. Yeah, it matches my birthday. Okay, so super. Like. Um, and finally, um, can you talk to us about the kit? I mean, as I said, you, we've been, you've been with us for three years and um, GNS Accessories has provided your suits and yep. boots and gloves, um, primarily Frank Thomas and you know you were the first rider that we got involved with and we're, we're our first ambassador so thank you for that. Um, has the kit been good and you know to, to just to tell our consumers um, what, you've, what your feeling of the yeah. market is? Yeah I mean ever since JNS uh, made the suits for us um, I've never had a problem with fitment, not once. Um, quality's always been absolutely spot on. Um, 
in an event of a crash, which obviously nobody likes having. <laughs> but um, and you have experienced a few. Of I have experienced like, a few. Like, yeah. um, but the suits hold up perfect. No, no battle scars as such. Okay. Um, you know, only minor bruises, but you're going to get that in any suit. So, but the the ultimate structure of the suit is, is perfect for what we do. Okay, and your Frank Thomas gloves, you, they, they've been... Yeah, they're like a set of mittens. Okay, so splendid. They're perfect. And we, we supply BKS boots and you've been... Yeah, the boots are um, perfect as well, to be fair. They, they fit, they hug your foot perf or well, and then the actual uh, torsion of the boot where there's no ankle movement or anything like that. So in the event of like an, um, an accident that involves your ankle, they are well protected. Splendid. Well, listen, Ross, um, from everybody at JNS, thanks very much for what you do for us, and hopefully, you know, we can go forward and make some inroads. Uh, certainly, then this year, and looking forward to next year and, and continuing with you. Perfect. Thank you. Okay, it's my pleasure.